Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Tiana Skara, and if you're new to my channel, I'd be so happy if you just press the subscribe button right down there. And if you're not new to my channel, welcome back. Okay guys, so today I'm going to be doing another hair review and this hair review is going to be brought to you by BlackHairSpray.com. They recently contacted me and asked me if I would do a review for them. So I said, of course, I mean, why not? It's free hair. So if you want to know about this unit that I'm wearing, all I have to do is just please keep on watching. Today I'm going to be reviewing another lace front wig and it's by the brand Model Model and it's in the style Free Part Lace number 202. The color that I'm wearing is number one and first I'm going to give you guys the specs on the wig and then I'm going to give you guys the pros and cons, if there are any cons. So basically there's two combs in the front, one comb in the back and then there's adjustable strap. Um, I didn't use the combs when I put on the wig because they fit the wig fits snug already. Neither did I use the adjustable strap. I already took it out because my head is really big, so I don't think that I needed that. So I didn't use that. Um, this hair is really, really soft. Also, it gives you three different ways that you can part the hair. So you can part it on the right side, the middle, or you can part it on the left side. But given you can't like tweeze the part, you guys know that I love tweezing all my parts. Any wig that I have, I love to just tweeze the parts to customize it and make it a little more natural. But with this one, I can't really tweeze the part because if I tweeze it, it's going to be still black. And all I'm doing is tweezing whereas like, you can see a black spot and then it's like it's no hair there, but it's just like this black stripe. So it's basically wasn't worth my while so what I did instead of leaving it to a middle part because I didn't like the way it made my head look like kind of like a cone head so I didn't part it down the middle I parted it on the side kind of and it's really not even parted I just put used the thing my finger pulled some hair and then like switched it over and I kind of actually like this stuff because it gives you like this body wave type look um cons about this week basically what I just said I do not like the parting it does not give you a natural part it kind of looks wiggish um you can sweep some powder over it but for me I don't really like the powder my fact I love to tweeze on my wigs I know it takes a little more time but excuse me I just felt like it looks way better than you sweeping powder over it like it just looks more natural so that's one of the cons about the wig Another con I would say is it tangles a lot. Like not not right now. It's not tangling because I combed it out. But literally once I put the wig on and I started to mess around with it, started trying to fix it to my liking, it started like tangling. And again, like I said in my other video with how do I maintain my wigs, I used my Y2 comb and just combed it out. It wasn't like a bad tangle. It wasn't nothing too, too bad. But it did tangle and I do want to let you guys know that it does tangle this hair is really really soft though like i can literally run my fingers through it it's so freaking soft i love the curl palette pattering i'm going to actually move up so y'all you guys can see it i showed it so someone in the beginning of the video but i want to show you guys the curl pattern again just so you guys can really see how it looks the curl pattern of the wig it looks really 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 nice i love everything about it and like i said this wig is so freaking soft for it to be a synthetic wig a full synthetic wig at this this is not a blend this is full synthetic it looks beautiful i really don't have anything bad to say about this wig i love it like it's i feel like this can be like an everyday wig for you if you're looking for something that's like really really easy to throw on definitely go check this wig out on blackhairspray.com this wig is to die for and it also comes in a lot of other colors and given like i said you can mimic this wig and make this wig go to your liking it's a lot of playing around with this wig that you have to do because like i said the part in space but if you just sweep some powder over your part you'll be good but another reason why i didn't sweep the powder is because like i didn't exactly know what type of part i wanted to do like literally when i first started filming the video my part was over this side it was in the middle it was over here so i didn't really know what i wanted to do with this wig but honestly i love it like this is the type of curls that i wear in my like i said in my other wigs all the time this is the only type of wigs that i like to wear that's like you know really really soft so if you're looking for a synthetic wig that's really, really cheap because it only costs 
30 it runs for about $50 but on blackhairspray.com they are selling it for 30 well $29.95 so I think you should definitely go check out blackhairspray.com so you can get it all on a deal even it's it's already cheap but you can get it for even a better deal and make it even more cheap so you're just saving more money I think you guys should go pick up this wig. This wig is really, really dope. I don't, like I said, I don't have really anything bad to say about this wig other than the fact that I don't like the parting space whatsoever. At whatsoever. But, I mean, I can always mimic it. Like I said, I love the way that my wig came out and I love these curls. Like, guys, literally, like, just pay attention to these freaking curls. And then look how easy it is for me to run my finger through it. Like, like I said, it did tangle, but it wasn't like a bad tangle that you couldn't like, you know, detangle it or like, you know, just make it look even more popping. Like, guys, this is one of my favorite wigs. Like, I used to always say my other wig, my outro wig was my favorite wig. This is literally my favorite synthetic wig that I've had thus far. I think this is going to be my new everyday wig between my Virgin U part and this wig. Those two are going to be my everyday wig. I freaking love these freaking curls in this wig like seriously guys you go to blackhairspray.com and buy this wig literally this wig is literally to die for like seriously guys look just please take a moment of silence for this freaking wig guys seriously if I, somebody was walking in the shoe with this wig on i honestly wouldn't be able to tell it was a synthetic wig i swear because it literally looks like it's human hair like it feels so soft and it's like it has like a coarse text like a coarse silky texture to it but it's it's really really like just nice guys like go pick up this wig if you guys are going to go pick up this wig from blackhairspray.com comment down below and let me know that you went and picked up this wig just because of my review a lot of you guys have been doing that lately so and i'm just it makes me more happy because then it's like i know that these re reviews are meaning something and they're actually worth me doing so if you go pick up the weight like i said comment down below you can check the description box below for the link to blackhairspray.com and the link to also get this wig on blackhairspray.com if you have any more questions if it's something that i did not answer just comment down below and i'll answer it but again thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys in my next video bye